Well, the connection between the Royal Australian Navy and uh, our Indigenous uh, elders and our Indigenous population uh, is fundamental to our Navy. Four years now I've talked about a thinking Navy, a fighting Navy and an Australian Navy and this is a, a natural connection uh, of all of those pieces of what it really means to have an Australian Navy. Not only is it a unique experience for me personally and for our Navy, but in terms of understanding that connection between uh, our modern protection uh, of the maritime environment and the ancestral way in which our native Australians have uh, valued, cared for and nurtured this land and these waters over many thousands of years. I thanks the Navy and our Royal Navy. I think it is really important for me to meet those people. That was really amazing because then our chief of um, Navy came all the way to meet Blumard Bay and Blumard Bay Sea. The uh, chief Navy came to recon uh, recognize himself. And I took him around. He went around and see all those uh, sea banks and also the rocks were in the, under the sea. Uh, it got name and you know the, uh, the, the song lines has been connected. I gave him a message and um, this is two or three uh, clan group. They all joined together and, and what a great uh, visit was. It was really important to us to come to country and understand what the Australian people expect of us and really connect with the Australian people um, and learn from them to make sure that we're doing the right thing we can to serve them and protect their land. The Indigenous Elders um, have shared with us honestly and openly and I'm really humbled on, on how kind they were with their time and also their lands. It was it was fantastic, um, definitely created that unity. Um, the, the way that we're welcomed into the Yongle community, they're just so friendly and for CN to have that connection as well leading from the top, it, it speaks volumes for us young Indigenous members and the younger generation coming through that the Navy are committed in moving forward. We just felt so welcome within the community. It also, just how rich their culture is, it was quite enlightening for me to see that rich culture. The experience that I had on this trip was so powerful, watching the Yolonga mob ceremony and just how they connect with their land and culture was truly amazing. And I think that's really important for the defence so we can establish that connection with the First Nations people so we can educate other people as well. And that's who we're protecting and serving. Ultimately, the Defence Force's connection with country is, uh, is absolutely paramount to our history, to our current serving generation and importantly uh, to our future generations.